I personally didn't feel the need to get into what was true and what wasn't. And, and, you know, well, did this really happen? Did it not? Because, you know, it's a novel. I mean, it, it, he certainly, he himself would say, look, it's, it's, it's a fiction. And I thought, you know, that's, and that's what had moved people. I'll dive right in. Uh, I was just so curious, how did you come across Grigory's book? What about the story made you want to bring it to the screen? What appealed to you about this adventure, this journey? I'd read the book. I bought the book in um, about 2004 or 2005. Whenever it came out in the UK, I actually saw it in a bookshop and was like, wow, that looks interesting. So, so I'd read it and loved it. Um, and uh, and I'd, I'd always kept this copy of it, you know, brought it when I moved to the US from the UK, you know, it came with me and I'd read it two or three times over the years, you know, I was, I was, a, I was a fan. So um, when the call came, you know, about, do you want to talk about adapting it? I was like, you know, I couldn't believe my look. I remember, you know, years ago when I was first starting in the industry, you know, they were trying to, you know, the thing's been in development forever. And I was, I was kind of jealous, you know, I felt like, oh man, I'm so far away from that, you know, and, as fate would have it, 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 15 years later, it came my way. I know Charlie sat down uh, with Gregory, but were you able to chat with him? And if if so, what kind of conversations did you have with him regarding the source material? Because I know there was debate on whether it was fiction or nonfiction and it influenced from his real life. I did talk to him quite a lot early on. Um, Greg was incredibly generous in that he was like, I'm here, you can talk to me about anything. Um, on the one hand, and on the other hand, he very much said, but I, I know it's got to be its own thing, you know. So he he very much was like, go go make it what you want it to be, but I'm here if you want me. Um, and so I talked to him a lot early on. And because I think in the end we were adapting the book and it's such an amazing story and narrative, I didn't want to – I personally didn't feel the need to get into what was true and what wasn't. And, and you know, well, did this really happen? Did it not? Because, you know – it's a novel. I mean, it, it, he certainly he himself would say, "Look, it's 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 a fiction," and I thought, you know, that and that's what had moved people. So, a lot of the insights were just about, you know, character and 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 you know, in a way, more about the character of Lynn he had written than his own life. But you know, he's incredibly, um, you know, he's one of the smartest people I've ever ever spoken to, Greg. I kind of, um, you know. He's uh, he's a far smarter man than I, and he's uh, insightful about everything. But you know, his take on India was just amazing. We tried to get that in there, and then just that that sense of you know, absolutely, someone who'd done bad stuff and was just trying to make amends. You know, that 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 idea of you know, trying to find redemption. You know, you all went through a bit of a rough production, from what I read, stopping, restarting, switching locations. So, like, what is it like to? How does it feel to finally? be on the precipice of release, see the final product. It's going out into the world soon. Um, I'm I'm really excited. You know, I'm very proud of it. It's sort of two things. I'm incredibly proud of, and look, and it was a huge team effort. Uh, you know, uh, I'm incredibly proud of everyone involved for uh, just getting it made. Uh, I'm then even more proud because I think hope, you know, not only did we get it made, but it's actually, you know, it's a pretty good show. Um, so yeah, so there's, there's a huge pride in the achievement. And then I just really hope, you know, people are entertained and, and, you know, it's sort of all for nothing unless the audience, uh, enjoy it, you know? Well, I loved it. So <laughs> right. There you go. I'm, I'm glad to hear that. Awesome. Well, that is my time today, but thank you so much. It was so great talking to you. Uh, you too. Thank you. Have a good one. Yeah, you too. Bye.